You're going to need two different types of patterned fabric, some ribbon, a pair of scissors, pen and paper and a ruler. Get started by drawing the outline of your stocking. Once you've finished drawing your stocking, then go ahead and cut out your Christmas stocking template. Your cut out template should look a little bit like this. Place your template on the wrong side of the fabric and then use a couple pins just to secure in place. Then go ahead and cut out your stocking on your fabric. You're going to need to do this step twice because you need a front and a back to your stocking. Once you've cut your stocking it should look a little bit like this. Now go ahead and cut the template for the top of your stocking. Using some fabric glue, you're then going to need to apply it to the top of your stocking. Apply a generous amount to make sure that it stays in place. Don't forget, you're going to need to do this bit for both pieces of your stocking, so both the front and the back need to be glued in place. Leave the top of your stocking to dry. Once it's dry, you should have a stocking that looks a little bit like this. Then if you can take your ribbon and just measure it out just by eye and then snip away. Apply some more fabric glue to your ribbon and then secure it in place. Again, do it on both sides and leave it to dry. Once it's all dry, secure your stocking in place and then pop it on the machine to sew it together. Then just snip away any loose ends on the inside. Once you've turned your stocking onto the right side, make a loop with some of the ribbon. This is going to be used as a little bit of a hook so you can hang your stocking. Secure it in place with a few stitches using a needle and thread. And that's it, you're finished. All that's left to be done now is for your stocking to be hung and filled with lots of festive treats. Bye.